So I asked for this opportunity to speak to all of you. But not as a man who's been out here to spit his catchphrases that has gotten on the nerves of people over and over again over the last 13 years. No. Today, I'm here to address a man named Mason Chronic. But I will not be addressing Mason Chronic as the Great One. T-G-O. I will be addressing Mason Chronic as a man named Jim. A man named Jim that first laced up his boots in the year 2007. A man named Jim that is responsible for the career that you have, Mason. Mason, you sit there and you stand there and you run your mouth about how I've done nothing for this industry. How dare you? How dare you? People like me, like Tank, like Devin Foolhardy, like Seth Stern, paved the way. We are the reason this industry exists. Not you. And then you sit there saying about how you wanted to be like the Great One. Let's get one thing straight, Mason. You could never be like me. And you know why? Because, unlike you, I travel the world seeking out the best competition. Any company, any league, any organization that wants to raise their credibility to the next level. Who do they call, Mason? Certainly not you. They call me. I don't pull bullshit like you. And we both know what you are talking about, don't we? We both know the reason why you left the States nearly a decade ago. And that's why I came at you last summer at Call All Stars 11. I came at you for one reason. Not because I don't like you. No, no, no. That's already been established. I don't even respect you. I don't respect the way you handle business. I don't respect how you pass the buck more times than you should. And I sure as hell don't respect how you refuse to take responsibility for anything you do. You run your mouth about history lessons, but TGO, hell, Jimmy Nitro doesn't believe in history lessons. Because history is dictated by those who want to serve you some of that bullshit. What I deal in is reality. And reality is my actions do the talking for me. Yeah, I run my mouth. But I do get in your head, Mason. And it's clear I've been in your head for a long time. And by the time I step in the ring with someone after I run my mouth, I've already won. And the fact is, Mason, I've already beaten you. And when I speak, I tell the truth. Something you know nothing about. How can you call yourself a murderer, Mason? When everyone you've ever been in the ring with leaves the ring alive, hmm? And here's another truth. I don't know what will happen at Call All-Stars 12 when you and I finally meet in the ring. Maybe you'll beat me. Maybe you won't. But one thing that will happen in Tokyo is that you will learn respect. <laughs>